The main clubhouse of Israeli Premier League side Batar Jerusalem has been damaged in an apparent arson attack. No injuries were reported. Police spokesman Mickey Rosenfeld said Friday's attack left extensive damage to the team's administrative offices next to the training field. A number of suspects at the early hours of the morning made their way into the offices and set fire to the whole place. Extensive damage has been caused and our units are carrying out an investigation in order to find both the suspects and who could possibly have been behind this serious incident. The incident comes the day after four of the club's fans were charged with anti-Muslim chanting at a recent game. Some Batar supporters are unhappy with the club's decision to sign two Chechen Muslim players last month. The football club were disciplined and ordered to close the Teddy Kolek Stadium's 7,000-seater Eastern Grandstand for five matches. Batar are the only Israeli side never to have signed an Arab player. The recent arrivals of Zawa Sardiev and Gabriel Kadiev have angered right-wing factions of Batar supporters and police have stated that they will deploy undercover officers to future matches to track down those involved in racist chanting.